I was into tech. Uh, I, I loved video games. Uh, I loved design. I do feel like Facebook for me represents the human experience layer of the internet. People are being much more um, open and vulnerable on, the, on Facebook than I see on other services. And I think that brings people closer together. Yeah. VR and AR will even more help bring people together. We've met before in VR. And then I think we would feel even more connected than meeting you for the first time yeah. here. VR has this capability of transporting people into something that really affects them on a more emotional level. Mm. And when people are willing to open up and kind of feel more emotionally mm. on that level, you understand each other much better and it becomes like an empathy machine. Yeah. And I think that's what we need on Earth now. VR is a safe space to expand your experience and do so together with people and kind of get more emotionally connected because you're doing these things together. Here you're actually, you, you have a joint memory together of being in that space. VR can be a very safe space. You could shoot him and you could play and in, play in, 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 in the toy box that you did because you know it's safe. But if I'm in VR, I can, we can build a scenario that's very lifelike, but it's safe. So I can experience things and I can push my limits. But you have to experience it to understand it. I think that's what you said. Uh, so pick your first experience carefully, <laughs> you know, similar to with other things in life. I'm more worried and excited about the software piece because that is more like a blank sheet of paper. Mm -hmm. Anything can happen. Mm. We don't know yet what the killer applications of VR is going to be. Mm. And I think that's, uh, that's really exciting. Now we're going to see the next wave, I think, with, with VR and AR. Mm -hmm. And I think uh, for young people in Taiwan today, um, start dreaming about what place in that value chain you want and what, what, you want yeah. to, what role you want to play. And if there's one p uh, this kind of piece of encouragement that mm -hmm. I like to give to young people in Taiwan, it is mm -hmm. to, to dream big and not just repeat history, but rewrite yeah. you know, the future. I think this is for the whole world, just as the internet has been a revolution globally. Yeah. VR and AR is an opportunity for, um, uh, for young people to really build and be part of the next revolution.